What's up everyone and welcome to another episode of Ranji.com Garage Shell Transformers Toy Finder or GSTF2 for short. It's the new show. Oh, I forgot about this intro. And in this episode, we're going to look at... Whoa! He didn't appear. He got caught by Optimus Prime. We're going to look at Age of Extinction... Deluxe class lockdown. To transform this guy into robot mode, you just do that. And there he is. In row no, I'm just kidding, guys. Of course, this, as you know, if you've been following Ranji.com's Garage Shale Toy Finds Season 1, starting from Season 1, this was uh, one guy we got from that lot, I believe. But yes, it's a hider, but it's also just a one-step changer, so you you can forgive it. Um, but no. we are... So this is not for Season 4. This is also Garage Sale Toy Find Season 4, Episode number 4. In this episode, this is actually who we're reviewing. And I've told you that I'm going to review Lockdown. Deluxe Class Lockdown. And so now... um Aha, Surprise! Surprise, surprise! Okay, let's get hey, Optimus Prime out Optimus of the way now. So, so that it doesn't unbalance. Okay, um. Okay, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to transform lockdown? this lockdown into robot mode and then we'll compare him with this guy. So there. Almost the same size. This guy is a little larger. I wonder though how this compares. With... Oh, we we did get Studio Series Lockdown. Oh my gosh, and that's the third, <sighs> lockdown. Yeah, the third lockdown we have. But anyway, it's just weird. So it's nice. It has a Decepticon logo right there. Not much else, but it's basically a hider, of course. Um, the but I mean less so compared to this little um, one-step changer but um, this doesn't have like a window on the side door which is weird and if you inspect closely basically there's there's a robot in there but there's shells so that's gonna be the thing a for this one so let's transform lockdown from yeah. car mode Lamborghini mode into robot mode and to do that Let's try to figure out um, how to do that. I guess, ooh, there you go. That whole side panel flips out. And uh, it looks like that's gonna fold back. And, um, and then we can now probably separate that one. That's gonna be his uh, legs and his um, waist. Waist, of course, yes. I'm just gonna okay, untap those, I've spin never that seen around. Waste in the episode yep, time. and then spin that around. Same thing on the other side, you mean. And now you have something like that. That's it's not, not yet it. battery mode because the legs should be at the back. Yes, so it's a well, this one tabs out. Mode. I don't know how this guy will look like, uh, but. Oh, some did some. Okay, looks like. Oh, that will. Sh Whoa, that is. So cool. Yes, then that this will fold in, I suppose. Cool. I now I just figured out the transformation right away. Nice. Oh, everything uh, just folds up like. So I don't know if you see that. Maybe not. So nice. Okay, let's um Okay, let's leave that there for now. Now we want these so this is going to form the arm. Yeah, you can basically see how it's forming out there. So it's actually a pretty nice transformation. The panels are a little bit out of the way. You see parts of the car as the um robot parts. Yep, that's nice, a nice touch. This part, there you go. And I guess we have to do that. Actually, 
Is that where it should go? I'm not sure. Looks like it. Actually, it's a neat transformation. Yeah. Pretty complex, if you ask me. Pretty nice. Okay. What does complex and, mean? Uh, not easy. And then um, over here, this thing folds around somehow. Maybe in. Nope. Yeah, I see that. Somehow it rotates. Yeah, there you go. That's going to be his arm. This just rotates and folds forward. Then everything is going to drop down. Collapses up. Collapse up, right? I know. Nothing collapses up. Everything collapses down. So this goes down like so. Oh, it's looking nice. I don't know what happens to this thing. I feel like it has it to fold up. The there you go, there you go. Yeah, there you go. And there it is. So it's a little thin so on the side. Down, actually. Wait, something has to tab somewhere and I don't know where. Oh. I mean, yeah, it looks okay now, but it won't stand on its own. So that's not good. Something has, oh, there you go. There's a little peg right there and I guess it has to peg in it's oh something good. fell oh my gosh something broke oh well uh, that what hap that's what happens when you force something I don't even know where that came from I hope it's nothing big but okay, I can't, I, I'm not able to for some reason. Okay, it looks like these will hide there and this will, yeah, there you go. It should tab in there, there you go. Did it tab in? Yep, that's how it is. I think that's it for this, um, I guess it's a deluxe class lockdown. But I'm not really sure. So let's uh, take a little bit of a measurement. Or just, yeah, here's her favorite deluxe. He's a little short. He's more like a warrior class. Little, yeah, about warrior class height. Uh, or the new deluxe height. Of course, we have here the one step changer lockdown. And of course, this. Push that, flip it up. Yeah, okay. And the, that yeah. lockdown is basically a... Oversized legend. Oversized legend. Um, there's one more figure I'd like to show you for comparison. Buddy, can you check out, um, maybe do a little review of that deluxe class lockdown? Okay, sure. So anyways... Uh, the similarities are these two parts are just like very much engineered. For this one, it doesn't have a Decepticon logo anywhere. But for this one, if you can see it, it's... With Daddy, can I bring Lockdown close up to the camera? Yeah. Okay. So if you can see, there's actually a tiny Decepticon oh, can't see that. logo. Yeah. Yep, it's right there. Very nice touch and nice detail in the face. He's just a little hollow. That's the problem. A little Hi. hollow there, but that's fine. So yeah, and he's short. So I guess he was not intended to be anything like a deluxe. But for comparison, we have here uh, Shadow Raider Studio Series, more or less, um, the Studio Series Lockdown should be the same size as this guy, uh, and he is noticeably taller. So that thing is not deluxe. Well, it is deluxe actually, it's more oh yeah, it is a little taller than deluxe, buddy. Nan, no Nan, oh, stop him, stop him. Nan, you're not supposed to do that. Okay, and plus so here you go. Terrain. That is, um, yeah, that is 
uh, what's his name again? Lockdown. Very, pretty nice. I must say though that, um, well, this guy also has a lot of kibble on the back, but he's a little more full, a little less hollow. He has an actual body, which is great. Uh, this guy, here. yeah, he's hollow, basically. Here. Yep, um, so now I'm going to transform lockdown back into vehicle mode. Let's just see, find out how easy that is. So first things first, you need to untab his back. And then you need to fold this out and a little bit forward. And then we are going to rotate, it. rotate everything and then fold this forward kind of. No, the waist folds, the waist folds back, and then the body folds up. Oh, it's like this, and then we're gonna fold this forward. Forgot about that, and this whole thing is gonna fold forward. That's but actually pretty nice, but um, one moment, buddy. Okay. Not yet. Uh, so it's gonna be more or less like that. There's his head, and then you have to spin these around like that. Spin this around, drop this down, dab them together, and you will do like a really nice ballet move. And this part, you're gonna flip it back, flip it back, fold it. Up. Oh, flip this around. Flip this around. Oh, th that's actually a pretty easy transformation back into vehicle mode. I still don't know where that little piece came from, which I seemingly, you know, dislodged from some part of uh, lockdown. Anyway, uh, yeah, it's actually pretty nice I'm gonna keep him in robot mode though so it more or less is gonna look like this uh, I guess there's some parts that are not yes there you go uh, and there you go and there you go and we can roll around nicely very nice so that is I guess you could say warrior class, lockdown, very small. I mean, small, but not too small. I, I'm not sure. Yeah, well, anyway, I'm excited to open my studio series lockdown just to compare him with this guy. But uh, for now, I'm going to just keep this guy uh, displayed in robot mode. So once you find out how to transform him, it, it becomes easy. I'm just going to do that very quickly because I want him to be in, in uh, robot mode in my display. So that's it. Um, you yeah. already said that. Yep. Man. Is it gonna go up like that? Or... Yeah, I guess it has to go up like so. There you go. And this one has. Hey guys. There you go, little snap. This one has to go back. So it's a little easier. Definitely the second time around. Oh, but not really. Hey guys, hey guys, just Nano. hey that that's uh, nanos, buddy. Mm. Right? Okay, well that's good enough. Good enough. Good enough. Untab, spin around, spin around, flip up, flip up, and there he is again. Well, that was fairly quick. 
And that's it for this episode of Ranji.com's Garage Sale Transform Toy Finder. That's also the end of Ranji.com Garage Sale Toy Find Season 4 Episode 4. We hope you liked this video. If you did, please click like. Please click uh, subscribe. Please click the notification bell icon. Please comment. Please share this video with your friends, your loved ones, your family, everybody you know. And that's it for this episode. Until next time. Ah, this is really a bad intro and outro thingy. <laughs>